you guys. I got a quick Oracle message. I'm going to read directly uh, from this guidebook, whoever needs this. I understand not everybody is ready to heal. Not everybody's ready for all this, okay? But uh, this is for whoever is ready to heal. Okay. Spirits, what do you have? Whoever needs to see this. Whoever needs to see this. Message for today. This is Heal Yourself Reading Cards by Ina Siegel. As you can see. Let me do this. Do this the right way. Okay. Self love. Good. Self love. Number 24. It's a very beautiful card. Okay. Oh, look, perfect. Self-love. Take time out to get to know yourself and what works for you in this particular cycle of your life. Some of the biggest obstacles to self-love are self-criticism and perfectionism. Feels heavy Virgo, huh? Okay, you could be a Virgo watching this. Which lead to harsh judgment of the self, closing down, and eventually illness. Have you been trying to compete with others, get approval from people in your family, or simply pushing yourself too hard? If so, you need to soften and start listening to your body. Focus on keeping your heart open and practice acknowledging and recognizing the good in yourself and in others. This card beckons you to breathe love in and out every moment of the day. Ask yourself, what changes do I need to make to my daily routine so that love can pulsate through every breath, action, and relationship I engage in? Choose to open your heart through softness, deep breathing, relaxation, movement, finding beauty in nature, in your home, in your pain, in your love, in your sadness, in your prayer, etc., Keep your heart open, even though it makes you feel vulnerable and exposed. This week is your opportunity to learn to receive. Anytime anyone says something nice to you or offers to help you, take a deep breath, thank them, and accept. You need to find something loving or nurturing to do for yourself. This could be a message, a healing treatment, or a movie with a friend. Every time you look in the mirror, repeat, I am lovable. Do this every day until you really believe it. 